Welcome, this is the energy vibration reading for um, the Aquarian Sun Moon Horizon. It is the last week of July 2018, and I want to say to each and every person, thank you for being here, thank you for being back. Okay, um, let's understand what is happening for you guys. Um, it is a week of hurt, the energy of hurt. Um, it's a week of working out a lot of karmas with a lot of people um, and uh, it is the sense um, where there is going to be wonderful positive situation and energies that is going on okay um, so um, let's look and see what is going on for you Aquarians okay we can see the energy of the um, earth sign happening because this is uh, the week this week is going to be a week of uh, um a lot of stuff going on okay um I, so maybe some people can feel it maybe some people can't feel it but the energy vibration on this planet is changing okay um you aquarians are going to have a week where a lot of stuff is going to be happening money is not going to be a problem you have the ten of pentacles on monday which is um very good the ten of pentacles is that you're financially stable on tuesday you're leaving an emotional situation behind some of you could be deciding to leave your family behind maybe some of you have to go to work um yeah where is somewhere else maybe some of you are trying to find new jobs and that sort of a thing so um you know it's hard it's heart rendering to move most of you are going to be traveling for work then we have the energy of the um, um, the eye princess, the number two energies, the energy of the eye princess. And um, if you're psychic on Wednesday, your psychic is going to kick in. It doesn't have to be on Wednesday. It can be any other day into this week, okay? Because these are general readings um, and uh, um, it affects people in different ways, okay? Then we have the energy of the four of cups. You're having some regrets about a relationship. Some of you have connected with someone that you have some regrets about and you're thinking about moving on, moving forward, okay? Um, then we have the energy of the five of wands. There is some conflicts at home. Some of you could be having conflicts at home. Some of you could be having conflicts um, on the work floor. Um, but there are conflicts that is going on and you need to um, resolve those conflicts. So, um, Saturday is going to be, um, or uh, sometimes some of you in this week is going to be having an end to a situation, okay? An end to a conflicting situation. Some of you um, could be having a um, conflicting situation with a family for quite some time, and so you're going to decide, I'm leaving this behind, and um, I'm moving away from this, and I'm going to leave this behind and move away from this, okay? Whatever you have decided, it has to do with family situation, okay it has to do with a family situation there um that was going on and you're going to just decide you know i'm leaving this behind it doesn't uh, serve me anymore um on sunday the energy of the hurt is here on sunday and this is good because it's as if some of you are planning um to um have a, a positive stability in your life and this is the energy that is coming in on Sunday so the weekend is the weekend of the hurt energy and this is um, very good so because you're you're vibrating in a week of fire and hurt okay so this is good so some balance is going to be coming in your life I know some people don't like this card but um, we need to face, <laughs> face our fear sometimes so um, um, we can understand what is happening around us okay so sometimes we need to, to face our affairs to know um, what is really transpiring and what is going on around us um, some of you are really having a family um, a family situation that is going to affect you in the beginning of the week and some of you are just going to be deciding to move on it doesn't have to be um, a situation with money it has to be a long-lasting conflict that has been going on and some of you are going to decide to move away from it but the energy of the Sun comes out to say that it's going to be um, working out okay it's going to be working out not to worry about this uh, situation because um, 
it, 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 it's going to be okay. Okay. It's just that, um, at this moment, um, it looks as if, you know, it's, it's, it's very bad, but it's, it's, it's going to be working out. Sometimes it is better to walk away from things than to get involved. And then you're just going to be feeling so aware of what is happening. Okay. So let's see what is this family situation you're walking away from? How does it affect you? Um, the eight of ones. Okay. The eight of ones is that, um, a lot of conflicts, a lot of information, a lot of uh, thing is coming at you. A lot of conflicts, a lot of information, a lot of talking, a lot of uh, stuff has been coming to you. You're trying to resolve this. You're trying to move away and that sort of a thing. Now, what happened is that, um, and I love using this card deck with this, is that a lot of, you know, it could be that the kids are home. On, on on vacation and a lot of kids are coming in and out of the house and that sort of a thing and some of you just need some um, peace and quiet some of you have to go for work the father is alone at work and uh, alone at home with the kids and he has to do his work and he yes and some of you are going to be traveling for work so your partner is going to be alone at, work, at home and that sort of a thing i'm seeing some of you going um are going to be deciding to put your parents in um in a house um uh or a vacation uh, house or um a tinder house because they're older and you're thinking that it's better so you're going alone to help them to make this transition because you think it is it's, it's going to be better for you okay let's see what else is happening because a lot of people are, are leaving behind something and it's as if the eye princess is saying, yes, leave this behind because it's not serving you anymore. Um, this energy of um, some of you will be receiving message. It could be from a child, but it is a message that is going to be coming in. Um, it doesn't have to be from a child. Um, but um, some of you could be receiving message if your child is an Aquarian, Gemini, or Libran, some of you could be receiving message. Some of you could be um, speaking very strongly to your children and let them know, you know, tool here and not and, and no further. Okay. The energy of the devil is here. Okay, so um, some of you, your intuitions and guides are saying there is a situation that you need to leave behind now there's a situation that you need to leave behind now okay it's as if the energy of the devil and someone could be coming towards you and 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 and, and giving you information that is not correct okay someone could be lying someone um whenever um the page of swords and the devil comes out someone whatever information you're about to receive they're going to be lying Okay, these persons are going to be lying. Whoever this person is, they're going to be lying. Okay, so whatever information you're about to receive, the person is not telling the truth. So um, be aware of this, that in the week um, you could be receiving, and it could be also that some of you are meditating and didn't close yourself off and you receive information that is not correct. Okay, so, so it, it can happen. You always have to close yourself off, okay? Um, let's see what is the outcomes of uh, the middle of uh, the week. Um, the middle of the week outcomes is that some people, um, you know, receive messages. It could be um, um, some people were asked and invited out for an... Um, um, yeah. um, you're looking for a job, and, you know, that sort of a thing, and people are connecting with you there is a situation that is going to be coming to an end some of you are going to decide this is not for it you know it's crazy but I'm 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 thinking the people who are going to be traveling in this week be careful at the airport something um, crazy is going to be happening at the airport okay I'm, I'm, I'm seeing that and then they're showing me this energy whatever is happening some of you are going to be leaving a situation behind and that is going to be much better listen to your intuition about this ending that is coming in this ending need to come in so if it's a career or whatever this ending is you need to leave it and let it come in okay some of you are going to be receiving a message um and it's going to be a message that is going to break your heart but whatever this message is it's not true 
okay so someone could be telling you something that is going to break your heart and um, it's not true um, someone could be very very um, um, it's as if these people are not being honest um, in the sense that whatever the message is something someone wants to um, um, give you pain someone wants to break your heart okay all right I, I don't know what it says but your message okay and the message that is coming in it has to do with um, um, an Aries Leo or Sagittarius whoever this person is uh, it is an Aries woman because the energy of the devil is uh, there um, whoever this Aries woman is she has an, a connection with someone with um, um, whoever this this Aries woman is it could be a friend it could be a relative it could be your mom and is as and, and it is and it is an Aries person for some of you some of you it's an Aries person some of you it's a Leo person some of you it's going to be and um, um, a Sagittarius person but whoever this person is they Either they're in communication with the with a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn man. Whatever the situation is, do not, you know, don't trust this person. Um, kind of hold this person off, okay? Because this person is a little bit jealous. Um, especially if it's an Aries woman, you need to leave the situation behind, okay? Listen to your intuition about this woman and this man. Leave the situation behind and listen to the intuition about this man and this woman, okay? There's a something very much off. These two are not um, speaking the truth. Um, some of you have some regrets that you have connected with this person. Um, if it's the Aries woman, the Aries woman and this man, there is just, and it's a psychic man. The man is a psychic man. Whoever this Aries woman is, it's like she wants him to, she wants him to do some work for her. Be aware of whoever this, um, this, this, this fire sign woman is because she's not coming out very healthy here. Okay, let's look at something else. We're looking at what is this conflicts and this conflicts coming to an end. Okay, um, the conflicts is coming to an end. It's not asking. It's telling you the conflicts is coming to an end. We have six of one, the seven of cups. Um, get out of the dream state. Stop dreaming because you need to be awakened and align to whatever is coming out. This is not only dreams, but it is also for some people opportunities. So as you... Um, leave the situation this behind this conflicting situation behind as you leave this conflicting situations behind you are going to be coming out of whatever the conflict is okay good news is going to come in so this is good okay good news is going to come in so um this is good all right so um the energy in the middle of the week is heartbreak it's, it's, it's or at break where um, some of you are going to decide to leave situations behind. Some of you are going to decide, um, I no longer want to deal with certain people, certain situation. Um, news is going to be coming in. And this news depends on who this news is coming from. If it's coming in from an Aries lady, do not believe her. Um, she's not being... If this news is coming in from an Aries lady, don't believe her. Okay, just don't don't believe her. Whatever whatever she has to say, um, don't believe her. Whatever has transpired in the past when it when it comes to family um situation um whatever has uh, ha, um happened in the past whenever it comes to family situation, you're going to bring an end to that. Okay, so beginning of the week and for some people who have been having conflicts um you're going to be receiving news that this conflict is going to be over okay um some of you are going to be receiving news that is going to be a little bit of heartbreak because the three of swords is there doesn't really matter what is happening it is good let it go 
um, it is you know there's an ending to a situation which could bring but I'm seeing the six of ones that is ending your reading so in the weekend good news is going to be coming in the weekend good news is going to be coming in about an ending of a situation a family situation that has been going on for a very long time and you could be receiving this news from a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn it could be from your father or it could be from a father figure because this person is over the age of 40 okay um, be aware for this Aries and not all Aries is bad and it doesn't have to be that is bad news because I'm seeing um, um, it's not really a bad person it's just um, some conflicting news it's as if this Aries lady she gets information but she, and her channel is not clear okay <laughs> and, and and this do happens that um, not all of us um, communicate from a clear channel or communicate that's why there's different readers okay because sometimes you can listen to some readers and you're not really connecting with them I want to say to you guys um, please listen to your Sun Moon Horizon sign and go back and listen to the month of July reading because I realize that a lot of you haven't been um, watching reading you need every week um, as you watch the weekly reading go back to the monthly reading because there's always information that is there that is not going to come out in the weekly readings or vice versa okay so the outcomes of your week is going to be very positive some of you are going to be receiving message in the weekend from um, um, a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn man some of you are going to be receiving message from an Aries lady um, some of you it could be from a Sagittarius some of you could be receiving message from your parents good news from your parents um, um, that you were waiting for so this is going to be good some of you are going to be receiving messages it could be from um, and, 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 and this is what they're saying is as if some of you who are psychic are going to be receiving message and that's not a good message Archangel Raziel is also here so um, obviously now the number nine energies is here okay all right um it's so weird with your reading we have six we have eight there's absolutely five we have seven we have absolutely no number the devil is six the energy of number six and sometimes things or you know people who with lower energy and that sort of a thing brings in good news um, but sometimes okay um, okay so they're saying move on you need to go out in the night some of you need to clear your auras by going out in the night okay Archangel Raziel is here he said joy true spiritual growth be a light to others answers that comes through meditation okay go out in the night sky some of you your energies need to be cleared okay go out in the night sky some of you energy need to be cleared I'm sorry I'm doing a segment on guiding angels this week it's the last week of July July was a month oh my god uh, seven of Gabriel come and seven of Gabriel said stand up for what you believe in have confidence claim your personal power okay so whenever I receive this energy because Archangel Gabriel because it's as if I meditate on um, and I listen um, what is it they need me to do in the week and uh, you know I have not had this card because I left it in Europe because basically I still have my stuff in Europe so but this is a deck that somehow I connected so much and my partner was coming over and I said to him please bring the Archangel that this is a deck that is just so powerful because it has these different Archangels the major arcana and this Archangel Gabriel is the angel with the passion so this is the seven of ones stand up for um, what you believe in have confidence claim your power okay and this is so 
powerful I'm loving this because it's the most powerful thing because I love the way um, Doreen does her cards because she always bring out and I remember beginning um, my series I used most of Doreen's card then we have the three of Raphael three of Raphael is here number three is going to be your energy vibration as well as six two times three is six um, and it says reason to celebrate a community of friends happy communication regarding um, a relationship and children okay so this is wonderful this is good um, three of Raphael is always the energy of healing okay um, Gabriel is the passion um, Michael is the sword um, um, fire and the sword earth and then the what am I missing the air the air and the fire the hurt cups Archangel Raphael is healing so it's the cups energy okay so um, the three of cups a celebration reason to celebrate wonderful energy I'm, 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 I'm laying it here but I still want you guys and I hope you guys can still see what is on the card because it's very important um, now we're looking at Archangel Michael what is he saying going in in a month end in the month he says four of Michael and he says insight that comes from quiet meditation the need for more sleep okay all right so obviously some of us is going to have some sleeping problems uh, um, in this week and um, insights that comes from quiet meditation the need for more sleep or time off seek relief from stress so you need to seek relief from stress whatever is happening for you Aries in this week you need to release um, release the need from stress and the last and final card is from Archangel Ariel I love Archangel Ariel eight from Ariel and she says take great pride in your excellent work um, practice make perfect consider getting additional education or training okay so good news um, by working hard good news is going to come in um, so this is wonderful and um, for some reason I so love this deck because I always do um, spiritual readings with Archangel decks and that sort of a thing and somehow I just stood up and this is what I received that I should do it like this and I'm using all five to actually crown um, this half this 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 month of July I'm, I'm ending the month of July and I'm sealing it off with the Archangels for you guys okay so ladies and gentlemen please remember to um, thumbs up like share these videos um hoping up the Sun is here um, the Sun with the ten of Pentacles is that whatever the conflicting situation with your family some of you are going to be receiving heart um, st um, stories stories that is going to have conflicting situation with you but not to worry and um, I want to say to each and every person life is about ups and downs okay life is about ups and downs and we need to understand that and no need to worry about what is transpiring we just have to understand that life is about ups and downs. I love you guys I love you guys so namaste until um, next month of August namaste